Hi guys. I had a bit of a problem the other day where I tried to upload a video which was more than 15 minutes long from my Apple device. Now, the problem is Apple doesn't recognise whether or not you are a verified YouTube partner. So if I show you here, I want to upload this 20 minute video. This is a demo video. And I go to YouTube and it tells me that the video is too long. Now, this is a bit of an issue if you've got a long video, but there is a way around it. First of all, what we need to do is close this down and then go to Safari. Now, if you go onto your YouTube page and then click on the upload function, you can actually select a file from your iPad or your iPod or your iPhone and then choose an existing video. Now, if we go to the video that we want, here's the demo video. Now, we click on Use, and what it does, it compresses the video. And once it's compressed, this does take a little while, it then progresses onto the upload page. So here we are, it's actually uploading my video, and I can call the video whatever I want from this page, give it a description, um, select whether I want to monetize, put it as private, set up the advanced options, etc. So um, we update that now. And then what we do, once we've done that, we click on done. What you do need to do is ensure that um, you keep this page active while you're uploading. If you don't, it will actually stop the download. Also, on the previous part where um, the, the actual file was compressing, you need to ensure that you've set your settings so that the, um, the screensaver doesn't come on. If it does, it will stop the compression and stop the upload. Okay, now we've updated that. We press done and it takes us to the page where we can just monitor the upload. Remember, keep this page open. Now this can take quite a while, but um, once you've um, pressed done, you can open a new tab to have a look at your upload page. And in the upload page, if there's any more editing you would like to do, you can do it from here. It's been a while now and the upload's finished. Now it's in the processing stage. Once you get to the processing stage, you can actually turn the machine off. You don't have to do anything else. Um, you can just go back to it later and then make any updates you need to make. Hope you found this useful. Please subscribe.